Uh oh, I guess she didn't want to be videotaped. Anyway, here we are in uh, South Lake Tahoe, and it's November, very beginning of the month, and it's our friend's birthday. Here she is. Uh, I guess she's, it's the big 4-0, even though she looks the big 3-0. So this is very joyful. There's Bruno Mars. No way. Seriously? Anyway, there's Sean. Well, I am Colombian. Uh, I live in the United States with my wife and son. Um, and these friends of hers are Filipino. And therefore, my friends. And so uh, I live in a Filipino household. And here we are. We wake up the next morning and it's snowing. Not too bad. I've seen worse as the world turns. So I uh, wake up and this is the first thing I see. And here are the kids. Uh, we are staying in a, in a timeshare, our friend's timeshare. Morning. And so uh, there are the kids. Very nice place. Uh, high altitude, so we are kind of out of breath and kind of out of it. But they're trying to wake up Sean. There he is. He just woke up. And I'm lying in bed. Here they come again. Here's the third ball of fire. These two little girls are twins, and this is their little brother. Take them off. And by the way, I am the godfather. My wife and I are the godparents of one of the little girls. I can't tell who's who. They're twins. So uh, <laughs> even though we see them quite a bit, I can never remember it's because their faces cool. are extremely similar to me anyway. There's Mr. Ball of Fire. And uh, he's fascinated with the fact that we're there. Uh, he gives me a big hello, I guess. He gives he he does me a tap in the tummy. Yeah. <laughs> okay. My wife is in the uh, comfort room. She's trying to get ready. There's one of them. They try to wake up Sean again. Sean is trying to sleep. I think he got like two hours sleep. <laughs> There's Mr. Ball of Fire. Okay. I can't remember what he was trying to do, but that kid's a lot of fun. Okay, I think so this is our uh, goddaughter. Is that Cassie? Cassie? Yes. Yeah. Hello. Hi. Hi. Hello. Hi. Okay. Okay. Whew. Anyway, we decided to go out for a coffee, and so we went out with the guys. And I totally like, totally like this place. Uh, Can this you rent is. The uh, uh, or you have to be affiliated with. Like, uh, yeah, I think so. I mean, I wish I could live here. Away from civilization, not too much, but. I guess less congested. Lots of trees, lots of snow, really cold. The cold weather here is different from San Francisco. In San Francisco... You have to teach me how to do that. Oh. There's Sean. I 
everything looks so fresh. I guess this is Genoa. There's Bruno Mars again, his girlfriend. Actually, this is our friend's daughter. Uh, second to the oldest. Uh, there she video. is. <laughs> I thought it was a picture. I, I can always make a picture <laughs> out of it. Some hay. Oh, that's my ancestor. Yeah, my ancestor. I don't know. Hi. I guess I'm... Uh, Hello? Well, being from Colombia myself. Oh, uh, I have I some off, honey. Sorry. indigenous Indian blood. We are about to get coffee. Here. My wife called. Blogging? Huh? Blogging. Blogging. Oh, she found out I'm oh. blogging. Oh, my God. There's her dad. So, this is it? This is it. Um. <laughs> nice little shop. Yeah, I've never been to this area. I don't know, it must be like 12 noon. <laughs> They're the three guys. <laughs> My three Filipino friends. They're much younger than me. And they decide to have a beer at noon. Of course. I can't do that, of course. Did you get your soda? There's Sean again. <laughs> Everything is nicely packaged. They got a little coffee shop and sell sandwiches and breakfast. Yeah, that's the one last time. Six September. September. Signature on there, please. Did you want a coffee, Percy? I just felt like buying everything. So this is very nice. Um, so are we still in Lake, in Lake South Lake Tahoe? Is that what this is? It? I'm completely lost. Genoa. I didn't know at the time. We're the bottom of the hill. Bottom of the hill. I guess this is in Nevada, where South Lake Tahoe is still <coughs> California. Just looked at the map. Cheese store. Yep. And our host is taking us to a to a cheese store, of course. For Julian. Oh, it's actually earlier than twelve. I think Thank it's like so ten a.m. because. Oh, very nice. The store, uh, the sandwich store is still closed. Uh, croissant. You have croissants? I don't. No. I'll find something. I'll be right back. I have like bagel sandwiches and English muffins. Muffins. I'll, I'll, I'll be right there. Oh, look at this, man. This is just unbelievable, man. Uh, I think I've been under a rock for a long time with this pandemic. Sandwich place? Yeah. Well, the food house. Okay. Um, sandwiches. Oh, but it's closed. It's closed right now, but they open at 11, I think. Okay, so, so it's not 12, it's probably 10. 10 a.m. Just magnificent. Oh, man. <laughs> Anyway, we went around and did a bunch of things, and so he, we're going back. We're going back to the uh, to the hotel. Okay. Timeshare. So. Airbnb. You should have went to like the mom's and pop store. So I said, forget about it. Dang, that sucks, see? So I, I just said, you 
know? Because we, we got that. I don't know if you remember, but we had a, a Volkswagen car. Then we had a Forester. Yeah. Oh, yeah, the Forester, yeah, I remember. Sold it for the uh, Volkswagen. But the Volkswagen was a big mistake, man. You should have kept the Forester. <laughs> no, I should have bought the van years ago. The Sienna minivan, that's what I was trying to say. Many people made fun of me for buying a van. Very practical. Who was it? There was a guy. Oh, he was driving um, bad for my He was driving an SUV. He buys a van, a white van, just like this. He was struggling because he had one of those uh, cars like that or something. And he had to put an extension up on top uh, to carry luggage and things because they're the three little kids. And then he couldn't get into certain garages. So he. You know that, right? Yeah. So he had an SUV, uh, and he had three kids, and he just couldn't go out places, you know, for road trips and so on. And so he finally bought a white Sienna van, and his life changed, of course. Here we are back at the hotel, Hot Hotel, Airbnb. I share. Our friend told us that there is no air in the room. The windows are closed. High altitude, we can't breathe. But it was so much fun.